Hello everybody and welcome to Dr. Rob Payne. Now before we start, I need to change my clothes to be a little bit more fitting. Wow, much better. I know this whole outfit looks kind of uh stupid but it's but it's okay we're not here to judge right this is a bob ross judge free zone i have a lot of chest space i know i can adjust these but do i really want to take the time to or do i want to get right into painting so if you haven't already guessed in this video we're going to be following a bob ross tutorial i just realized i have two canvases we only need one now i actually do have two cameras for this this is the first camera this is the second camera this is going to take a god awful lot of time to edit. So if you please, for the love of God, just leave a like. I'm begging you. But that's all I ask. Just go ahead and leave a like and sit back and enjoy. Now, I actually got a Bob Ross set. This was about 50 to $80 on their website. It was a lot of money. One, two, three, four, five colors. I don't know why I needed to count that out. And it features his knife, liquid white, and his his uh, his, his um his uh, signature brush. Oh boy, a CD. Wait, that's not the CD. This is the CD. The CD. Oh boy. Certainly glad you could join us today, because it's a fantastic day here. It is I hope fantastic. It is wherever you're at. So I tell you what, let's start out today and have run all the colors across the screen all the colors. that you need to paint along with us. First, we probably should get the colors on our canvas, right? So it starts with Tantanium White. Luckily, I do have Tantanium White. I know I don't have all the colors. I only have five. I do have a set of extra colors, so if we if we need to use a knockoff brand, I'm very prepared for that. Bruh, this, <laughs> this is an opening. Bruh. Uh, if you couldn't tell, I'm kind of skinny. I have quite scrawny arms. I'm, I'm getting off track. Actually, I have a solution. I'll be right back. All right, so here's my solution. I'm going to be ruining the tip of it. I'm aware of that. So we're going to squirt some of that onto our palette. Squirt like that. Pretty good amount there. I know he just squirts a bunch on his. That's a freaking lot. Persian blue. Thalo blue. Same thing, right? <coughs> I have my standard old double prime pre-stretched canvas and today I'm using an 18 by 24 inch. You use whatever size is convenient for you. And this is not 18 by 24. It's very, very thin, say that again, thin coat of the liquid white. Oh, we actually do have liquid white right here. So I'll have to apply that real quick. Um, I'm actually just gonna squirt all the colors onto my palette. I don't care what he lists. We can just make colors along the way if we don't have it, right? Um, I am ordering a little microphone for my Plague Doctor mask. It'll be a little bit till it arrives, so right now we just have to go with the Soviet look. <laughs> Dude, how weak am I? Ah, uh, I'm gonna go get my brother, see if he can open it up. My beefy brother can't open this up, so I've deemed this impossible to open. It's just no man can open it up. Oh my god! The lid came off, but... Not this. Dude, we got it open! But as you can tell, this is the liquid white. We're going to just dip our brush lightly in liquid white. And then we're just going to up and down. Up and down, baby. Thought we'd do something today that's just fun. We filmed the show in Muncie, Indiana with old two inch brush, a little bit of. Let's start with a little Indian yellow. Let's make a. Bruh, I don't have Indian yellow. Uh, this isn't Indian yellow, but it. Looks kind of close, so I'm going to take that. A very simple little sky. That, oh, a little you sky. Can move with no problem. No problem. Very, very simple. Just a fun. For this, we're actually going to use his official brush. A little bit. Oh, crap. It already just all got on my brush. So then he just starts going like this, right? I'm just going to go into a little bit oh of yellow. Oh, my God. His is so much yellow than mine already. Oh, my God. Ah, there we go. Beautiful night sky. It's sort of a gold color. We'll go right above that. Just a little. Just a little. About like that. And then just, just blend them together. Go off the excess. <laughs> and just beat the devil out of it. And then you just beat the devil out of it. Well, I'm not going to do that at my parents' house. Bobby, why does mine look so retarded compared to yours? Into midnight black. Dude, I don't even have black on my palette. Uh, are we using the same brush? All right, man. One black together. As you know, it makes green. Wait, wait. Blue and black make green? <laughs> Doesn't it just make it darker? Wait, I just missed something. And if we're real careful, we can bring it right down into the yellow. 
right where they join without ending up with a bright green sky. Bobby, like mine's that. not blending. Okay, Bobby, you're going quite fast. I'm still in the sky. You're already on the clouds. Yeah, I'm just going to take a whole bunch of paint this time. Yeah. So now he's just adding some clouds. So he like... Tell you what, maybe it isn't... So he just taps it. Bobby, mine don't look like clouds. We're going to be blending these clouds in a little bit. I don't know. This piece of canvas truly is your world. And then we just wipe it. This is a terrible idea because it didn't actually clean my brush. Ah! I'm going to be honest, after I blend it, it doesn't actually look half bad until you look at his in comparison. Let's use a little one inch brush. I'm going to grab the knife. I want to make some brown. I'm going to make quite a pile of brown. I'm going to use it throughout the painting. Take a lizard crimson and sap green. So I actually do have that Bob Ross knife he describes. I regret using the knife. We just use a little one inch brush and go right into a little bit brown. Just gonna use it for- Bro, Are we only gonna be using this brush? Cause I only have one of this brush. It's gonna be some Wait, what is he doing? Very basic little shapes. See this? This is not freaking brown. Scroll. Bobby, why why does mine look like- Autism. Green Whoa. here. Bobby, you go so fast. I was still painting this and now you're already making a new color. Bro. Just tap in the indication. Am I not adding anything far, to far it. away. See there? And vary the colors a little bit. Bro. And it brings so much happiness to so many people. Boy, it's not, it's not really bringing happiness to me because this looks so garbage. All Dude, colored. his trees look so real. How is that even? What dark magic is he using? Here and there and there and here. I'm just going to put the indication of a few little, little trunks and stuff. Okay, so now he's adding trunks and stuff. Brown plus paint thinner? Well, I don't think I want to grab paint thinner. I'm just gonna grab some of this brown stuff. Let me just wash the old liner brush. Dude, how did he do that so fast? The second I touch this, it just mixes in with the other colors. Alright, those look like trunks to me, and I don't know what you're talking about. I'm the master. I'm the Pagosco. The brush here is not too dirty. Bro, we're, we're, we're back to this brush. Brown and black. A little bit of sap green here and there just to give it a little green and shoe. green? Maybe there lives some land right here. We're going to do a little scene. How does this field look so realistic? I think I just need a dark green. Oh, now it just looks stupid. What if we just put like red? That was a terrible idea. Why did I add red? Now it's, there's just like a random red spot in my painting. This so isn't making green, Bobby. This right is there. making there's throw one up just yellow. Like that oh, he's adding here. highlights. And think about the lay of the land, or how the land flows. The beautiful little grassy areas, just just go all through all your different yellows and your greens. This is modern art, you see? It's 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 beauty. It's just, it's something you've never seen in your life. Nice place. He's adding a barn? Oh, he's using his knife to put that on. Okay, uh... I don't know how he just doesn't, like, scrape the paint off. Mine's not adding it, it's just subtracting it. Oh my god! What the look at it? Just look at it. Yo, art students in the comments, should I join your college? Do you think I'd be able to master the art in your school? Also, now he's doing like a brighter brown. This isn't helping, Bobby. Wow, I just had like a strip of red on there. Wait, you know. Wait, that's blue? Oh my god. This entire time, what I thought was black, I was just adding a super dark blue. That's the reason why my painting looks so bad. It's just because of that. Silly me, man. That's right, I'm fixing it. I was right. I just need to add a little bit of white to show the different parts, like that's the roof and stuff. This farmer is like me. He needs more room. Let's give him a shed out here. Shed? Did he say shed or sh**? Alright, we're just gonna call it a shed. <coughs> He's already adding a door? What do you mean? Perfect, dude. It's like basically identical. You guys ever think like he like screws up on camera and he's like <laughs> entire crew's like, oh, calm down, Bobby. We don't want you committing another manslaughter. Bobby, I turn away for one second and you already have the entire United States already painted. Dude, he's making basic trees? Shapes. Think yeah. about patterns and shapes, though. Don't just throw them in at random. Oh, don't throw in random? That's what I've been doing the entire time. So easy. Little it's so there. easy. Shut up! And so Bobby wants us to make a huge tree. And he's got some crooks and some... I like trees. I like trees too. Trees. You can definitely tell mine's just basically reality. Like, you look at mine, you just forget that you're looking into a painting. Oh yeah, we gotta sign it, don't we? Okay, let's sign it real quick, because everything is running out of battery for me. P. Can we give a little side-by-side -side comparison? They are basically the same thing. 
Anyways, if you don't subscribe, I'm going to pull your teeth out with this very wrench. My phone is very close to running out of battery. So I am going to see you guys all in the next video. Goodbye.